Yeah, one thing I always try to do is convert my some of my dollars, my bills, to coins, and, and I leave them in the can. Then I take them to the bank, and before you know it, I have saved a lot of money that way. Because we see, you see, uh, when you have bills, you want to spend it easily on something, buy things, buy things here and there. But if you have coins, uh, you save them. You don't want to hang around with coins. So, you know, uh, so that's why I, I like to convert my coins, uh, my, my dollars, my dollars into coins, and then I take it to the bank. And before I know it, I saved a lot. And uh, I can take a trip, a, a, a summer vacation with my family, uh, go to, the, uh, to a nice restaurant, go to uh, buying clothes, do a lot of things I can do that with these coins. So that's what I do. Look at how heavy this is. It's so much to the top. Almost to the top. It's a lot of money. These coins can uh, uh, can can get you uh, to a lot of places if you uh, know how to uh, save them, how to collect them. So getting coins is very important because you can it's a, you won't spend it. You don't, you don't want to carry coins in your pocket, right? But if you have dollars and bills, twenties uh, and tens and five dollar bills, you want to spend them in everything you see, right? Uh, so that's what I do. I take my dollars and five dollars and ten dollars, and I try to convert them into uh, into coins. And let me tell you, uh, you can save a lot of money. You can do a lot of things. Put into the bank. It's a way. I, that's a strategy I use to uh, be able to go on vacation or buy clothes or go to a good restaurant and eat. Yeah, because I save up my coins, buy clothes. Yeah. So it's a good strategy. It's a good uh, thing to do in, in, uh, in, in saving money. You probably say, oh, I don't see that much coins. Oh, you can. You can. If you, if you know some people who have, who have uh, dollars, uh, you know some people who, are, who have coins and um, they want to convert it to uh, dollars, you can do that too. You can do that too. You can do that too. Mm -hmm. Some people have coins. And they and they, and they want you to give them dollars for it. That's good too. And then you take the coins later on to the bank. It works many ways. All right, let, let's let you know. This is very heavy now. It's almost to the top. Once it, when it gets up to the, this level here, about up to here, I want to take it to the bank. It really works. A lot of coins. Believe me, there's a lot of dollars here. A lot of dollars. Don't be surprised. Don't be fooled by this small container. This small container carries a lot of money. All right. Of course, you know. Uh, uh, of course, you know that if you have more quarters uh, and dimes, uh, it, it, it adds up. But if you have a, 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 container, a container full of pennies, then eh, not that much. But believe me, this has the quarters, dimes, nickels. It add up, and you should always. You, if you want, if you want to go on vacation right now in the summertime, save up your coins, take them to the bank. Convert it. If you, if you know somebody who has coins and they want you to give them some dollar bills for it, do it. Put it. They put the coins in this container. Take it to the bank. See, my bank that I go to has a coin machine. I can put the money into the machine and it goes right into my account. Or when you go to a supermarket, save your coins like this. You go to a supermarket, they have a coin machine, some of them. You can buy food. Of course, you have to pay a certain amount of percentage, maybe 15%. Uh, to the to the supermarket, but you can take all these coins to the supermarket, put them in the machine, get a little receipt or a little tag or whatever, and then when you when you, when you shop for food and you and you and you're ready to pay for it, you give them the uh, the tag, and they will deduct that because you pay for it, right? That's what it is. So uh, you can take it to a, a supermarket, and before you know it. Uh, you can get food, but of course you have to pay a little bit of money for the services of the machine. Uh, what, fifteen percent, I think. So you really have to have a lot of coins. But it can do that. You can do that and get food. That's lots of things you can do with coins. Lots of things you can do with coins. Lots of things. You got to know how to use your strategy in your mind. You have to know how to 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 uh, to um, think things out. So this is this is gonna look like uh, this doesn't look like it's much. But it is. Believe me, it's heavy. It's a lot of money. All right. Have a good day. Over and out. Bye-bye.